of um, the personal um, form, thought form self as being the center. It, it always is pointing to the Father. So spiritual pride uh, could come in many different ways and shapes and forms. It could be a, a pride with a group. You may identify with a particular spiritual group, or sometimes they're called cults, and there's an identity there that um, we know the way. We've got the way. You know, the rest of the world doesn't. We've got the way. And this is another um, spiritual trap among many that still attempts to identify with uh, a small I, a personal self. Pleasure. Pleasure is part of uh, the world of duality. Again, we could speak of pleasure pain. There are two extremes, uh, both equally unreal, both uh, defenses against the truth in the sense that um, both are, are very helpful techniques as far as the ego goes in terms of uh, making the body real and maintaining the body identity. Once again, the mind is can perceive the flesh or recognize the spirit, but it's one or the other. They, they are mutually exclusive in awareness. So that if one is aware of the body and one is aware of the world and so on and so forth, then the recognition of the spirit is kept from awareness. 